start the 35 mile week. My six miles before work. So it's very nice. miles following on where I left last time and all the way around to open suspension bridge. There's cows already so I just walk past them. Get all chilly in the sun. I think I found the place with the best bins. And yes, I went the wrong way around to avoid cows. Oh, it's a really good day for it, but it take me so long because I stopped to look at the views or to go around cows. But yeah, it's, um... I've stopped with this the view. This is my, my day out. It's going to be a day because it's going to take like four hours. But we'll at this very because I'm sat down. But, oh no, Abby told me off for saying but too much. So I'm going to try not to. She didn't tell me off. So, get my first snack out and then I'll continue running. Just trying to practice a little bit eating whilst running. So, so it's a good start. 30 minutes in. This is kind of how I want to continue. I didn't follow the actual map. I thought, oh, there's a footpath, so I'm going to go that way. So now I'm rewarded for walking up this hill because I just wanted to the top of it and I could have missed it out, but no. Look oh. giant marshmallows. Huge. It's a really big fire. i been walking up the hill. It's very important to turn around and have a little look. Hello again. Um, following this bit here, uh, it's quite steep. So we've got a little walk up it, a little chat. Maybe if you pause my watch, if you could care. Friends of chat. It's a 35 ish mile week this week. It was a 30 plus mile week last week. So we're in a couple of long weeks for my first ultra. I mean, it's not a super long ultra, it's 55k because I've done the marathon. So I feel kind of okay about the distance. I'm more excited for it. Bit of eating, running. Not so excited about the prospect of all this sun though. It's very sunny today. So very gravelly. Gravelly? Big stones, not gravel. There wasn't much chance of me going any faster or talking up there. A little bit steep. Probably actually a very steep bit on my route when I planned it. But there are lots of people and I'm quite shy, but hence there's no talking in like most of the videos. So I'm going to not talk. So nice out. Give me fields and hills and things to trip over on any day. I shouldn't say that I haven't fallen over yet. So my 17 mile run today, probably more because it's me. And I already avoided one field of cows. But I should end up around at the suspension bridge. No, there's no shit, I will end up there. <laughs> if I don't then I've gone very wrong. Um, so I'm having a nice adventure today because long trail runs are adventures. There's no speed, it doesn't matter how fast, just need to enjoy it, which I am. Finish it in one piece 
and have a good time. Oh, I ate some snacks. What a beautiful food. You probably can't appreciate it as much as I did. I bet you have an actual good view. I like the one over there which was into some trees. I'm sure it was a good view at some point. Well, a bird pooped in my hand just now, so that's surely good luck for the rest of this run. I keep thinking, is it actually a run if I walk quite a bit? And I'm like, yes, yes, it is still a run. I mean, it doesn't matter how long this takes, I still couldn't walk it this quickly. And I'm just having a good time. Like, really enjoying it, it's just so nice out. I haven't actually met that many people for it being so good. So when I get to a little shop, I'll buy another drink. Um, have a little sit here. Been doing some normal runs during the week, lots of road running and now this week I'm still here, haven't gone back home so I decided to do another long trail run which I actually find a lot more fun because I have no idea really where I am. Well I do know where I am but I've never been here before so it makes so pretty, so overgrown. I have a clue where this path went. I'm a bit confident though because there's cows in it don't film. But this garage is so long. There's no path. The gate's there. Oh look, there's a bit of a path. I can't see any of it from the other side. Also, I just got really scared by a pheasant. I think it was a pheasant. Don't know who's more scared, me or him. Didn't really know where to go. Didn't work out to the footpath of in this way. It's a dog. I just got to the top. And he's chilling with a horse. So now I'm going to go in the gate over there. I think that's the gate. some water and brought a coke. Um, yeah, got a nice five, six miles left. Very sunny but some very good views. Um, yeah. Still having fun. Still having fun. Stop for some water and got a fat jack, which is cherry bake for. And we've got about three miles left. What a good day. Look at this. I feel like I've just given up. I don't really know what I'm saying. Well, that's reassuring. Hopefully, I make it. Oh, my battery will probably run out before I get home, but we've got. I'm still going to say about three miles to be there. But oh no, that's rounding us. Did my 17 miles. But got to do a bit where part of the path was still today. That's nah, still terrible. Got to a bit where half of the path was sharp, but they don't tell you that until you're there. And you could have gone a different way. So now I'll give it up and walking because I don't want to go this way. <sighs> um, that was bad feeder. I mean, it doesn't actually have that much on. Just I didn't want to go this way. But now I'm walking. I feel like I should be running because it would be a heck of a lot quicker. Now I'm over my strop now. Over it. Didn't add that much more on. It's fine. And this bit's quite nice. I don't mind going up here. Would have been fine going up here to begin with. 
would have just liked the sun to tell me to go up here and all the way down there. At least this is in the shade. 